Fortnite squad. What is going on guys and welcome back to a brand new video. Today we're going to be covering the Season 8 Week 8 Challenges. Now you might have already seen me do this video. Now the reason I'm doing it again is purely for the fact that as I always say the Epic can change any challenge at any given time. Well this time they kind of changed every challenge. Uh, so we're guessing that those challenges before that were leaked were just placeholders. Uh, so now we have the official challenges that came out with the 8.4 patch. Uh, so they're not actually out yet, but what I mean by that is they were in the game files and they have been leaked. So jumping straight into it, but first I would like to ask you guys if you haven't already then smash that subscription button down below. Also turn on the notifications, that way every time one of these sort of videos goes up and a change happens within Fortnite and I make a video about it, you will be notified directly to your mobile device. Now that's all said and done, let's jump straight into it. So the first challenge guys is a stage, a two stage challenge. So stage one is search the treasure map signpost found in Paradise Palms. Now if you don't know where this is, it currently sits around about the center of uh, Paradise Palms. It currently has no map found on it, uh, but I will add a screenshot to the screen right now so you can see the location and where it is. Now the second part is search the X on the treasure map signpost in Paradise Palms. So once you have searched it already, you then have to go to the location once the map is released uh, of where that X is going to be. So I'm going to guess it is going to be a whole map of the island and then there's going to be a treasure X and that is the location you will have to go. So that is the first challenge. Now for the second one, you have to use vendor machines in three different matches. So basically this one is simple as obviously they added the updates so they no longer have to pay with materials for the vending machines so you just simply have to find three vending machines and use them. So that is the second challenge. Now for the third one you have to deal 100 damage to opponents while using at least one balloon. Balloons are very common at the moment so this shouldn't be too difficult to do uh, but again it's all down to the person using it if it's hard for people to shoot but all you gotta do is deal 100 damage uh, basically one kill without any shields. Moving on to the next uh, challenge, search seven jigsaw puzzle pieces under bridges in uh, in caves. So basically, this is a new one that hasn't been released yet, uh, so it hasn't been updated into the game mode. But once the challenges go live, I'm guessing there will be an update and there will be puzzle pieces within bridges and caves. We don't know a great deal about this one yet, but as I said, um, once the challenges are actually released we'll know a bit more about them. Also I'll be uploading videos on every single one of these challenges because they all pretty much require uh, some sort of guide and tutorial on how to do them so I'll be covering how to do these each video at a time. Now for the third, uh, for the next challenge guys we have another two stager. Uh, so the first part of the stage is dial the Durberger number on the big telephone west of Fatal Fields. Now I haven't actually seen this telephone uh, but I'm guessing it came out with the 8.4 patch but I haven't actually been in game and seen this but I will find a screenshot and I'll put it up on the screen now for you guys to see. The second stage of this uh, two part is dial the pizza pit number on the big telephone east of the block. Again haven't seen the giant telephone east of the block either but I will put a screenshot up on the screen now for you to be able to see. Moving on to the next challenge we have to eliminate seven opponents at Dusty Divot or Lucky Landing. Now this one is worth 10 battle stars, so it's one of the season pass challenges, um, so not everyone's going to be able to do this challenge, uh, but the people that hold the season pass, which was free this season, so there's no reason anyone shouldn't have it, but you have to eliminate 7 opponents at those two locations. Now for the final challenge guys, you have to eliminate 2 opponents from at least 50 meters away. Uh, again, not too difficult, can be done with an assault rifle, a sniper rifle, even a hand cannon, anything like that really. It's probably going to be your best bet. Potentially an SMG, but you're going to have to put a lot more ammo and your aim is going to have to be more on point because it's going to do less damage at distance. But that's basically all the challenges for the week 8 season 8 challenges guys. I hope you did enjoy this video and again, uh, I'll put in the disclaimer again, just in case. Uh, these challenges can change for whatever reason, there's not much chance of them changing now because it's so late into it. But if they do, uh, I will then make another video updating you. In fact, I will put a pinned comment down below. Um, I will edit that if anything changes. So I hope you guys enjoyed the video. If you did, be sure to leave a like, favorite, and a comment. And as always, I will see you in the next video. Peace out, guys.